What's up guys, it's Taylor. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you clicked on this video, you probably have a similar obsession to Trader Joe's as me. So for today's video, I'm gonna be sharing my favorite Trader Joe's items that I just keep on repurchasing because they're just so delicious and I just have to spread the word. So I really hope you guys enjoy it. And if you do have any Trader Joe's suggestions for me that you think I should try out that I don't mention in the haul, definitely let me know in the comments below. The last thing I will say is just don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment and let's just get into it. Okay, the first thing you need to try out because they are just so delicious are these Trader Joe's Everything But The Bagel Nut Duo Almonds and Cashews. These are like the perfect salty snack. Hopefully you guys have already tried Trader Joe's Everything But The Bagel Seasoning. I feel like most people have at this point, but if you haven't, it's kind of like a garlic salt sesame seed like mix and it's super good and that is the seasoning that are on these nuts and the best thing is that nuts are such a good like healthy snack so these are just perfect i've been stacking on them a ton super random but my cat is sitting on my kitchen counter right now and she's sitting like directly through the crack of my door and staring at me so yeah a little creepy next up i have a super yummy breakfast option that i know you guys will love so it's trader joe's buttermilk protein pancakes these are so delicious and super easy to make you literally just add water to the mix and then obviously cook them but what's great about them is they're more like guilt-free pancakes and they actually have 10 grams of protein and 29 grams of whole grains and two pancakes i usually make like three pancakes though because who is satisfied with just two nobody i usually make these on the weekend when i just want like a sweeter breakfast another must try item is this balsamic glaze it's literally so good and just like the perfect finishing touch for sandwiches or avocado toast it just adds so much flavor i was just thinking that this would actually be really good on top of a margarita margarita pizza so i'm definitely going to be doing that it's so delicious it's like three dollars i just i can't live without it now then we have trader joe's frozen sweet potato fries these are so good they're such a good like healthier alternative to french fries you can either just bake these in the oven or what i like to do is make them in my air fryer and it's just so quick and easy they get nice and crispy and are just so delicious honestly they're just a great side to have on hand when you're craving some french fries but you still want to eat healthy so this next it was actually a very recent find of mine like i literally just tried it out today and i didn't think i was going to mention it in this video but like right when i tried it i knew i had to they are trader joe's everything but the bagel seasoned kettle cooked potato chips i have been eyeing these like the last few times that i went to trader joe's i think they're like a newer chip but i am obsessed with this seasoning and i just knew that they were going to be amazing and they definitely are if you're a fan of the everything but the bagel seasoning then you will freaking love these Trader Joe's definitely capitalizes on that seasoning because they just know that everyone loves it so they add it to like so many different foods and i know that i haven't tried out like every one that they have like i'm pretty sure they have like a cream cheese and a salmon like there's probably even more than that but they are smart like they got me so if you're really into spicy food and you love garlic then i think you'll really like this next item so it's trader joe's chili and garlic cashews these are so good they have like a little kick to them and what i love about these nuts and the everything but the bagel nuts that i showed you guys is that they're actually pretty cheap for like a bag of nuts i feel like they're like four dollars and i feel like most of the time it's like ten dollars and Am I wrong or is that just because these are cashews and maybe these are like a cheaper nut maybe but either way it's still a really good deal and keep in mind that my boyfriend and I have already eaten a ton of these but yeah these are just so good I definitely recommend trying them out bringing it back to another great breakfast option we have Trader Joe's unsweetened instant oatmeal it's actually a really good oatmeal it's made with whole grain oats quinoa amaranth I hope I'm saying that right with flax seeds and cheese seeds and on top of that it is it's gluten-free and it comes in individual packets like this it's super easy to make you just put it in a bowl with some water heat it up in the microwave and you're good to go and then maybe throw some toppings on it i usually put like peanut butter bananas cinnamon and I think that's it. I think that's like all I put and it's super delicious. Wow, this is just such a yummy, healthy breakfast that I always look forward to. Okay, I just totally spaced on a really important ingredient that I put in my oatmeal. It's actually the next thing I'm about to share with you. So it is Trader Joe's Ancient Grains and Nuts Granola. This stuff is so good. It adds the perfect crunch to your oatmeal. But the reason I specifically get this one from Trader Joe's because they actually have tons of granola, but granola tends to be really high in sugar 
sugar so that's something I always look for in the ingredient list when I'm picking some out this one was pretty low in sugar compared to the other ones I think there might be one more that's slightly lower but it was like a coconut one and I don't love coconut so I got this one instead it only has eight grams of sugar for a three-fourths cup of it 220 calories and five grams of protein so I thought this one is pretty good and I love that it has like grains nuts and seeds in it next you have a really good item for my pasta lovers so we have an organic brown rice penne pasta that is gluten-free and sodium-free. There's nothing too crazy about it. It is just pasta, but what I really like about it is that it is made with brown rice because the brown rice is a lot healthier. I love me some carbs, okay? Want a good topping idea for that pasta? Then look no further because definitely try it with this Trader Joe's smoked apple chardonnay chicken sausage. I freaking love this stuff. I mention it in every single Trader Joe's video that I have probably ever made because it is just my favorite they do have other chicken sausages at trader joe's but i love this one just because the flavor is amazing first of all and also there's only two grams of sugar and then 16 grams of protein which is just amazing if you want a really good like healthier dessert option then definitely try out the dark chocolate covered mini pretzels these are to die for i am obsessed with them dark chocolate is a lot healthier than milk chocolate so whenever i get like any dessert i always get it in dark chocolate these are like the perfect sized pretzels and five of them is a serving so i usually try to stick to the serving size so they don't get too unhealthy you know these are just so good and i usually keep them in the fridge so they're nice and cold when i eat them because for some reason it just makes them taste like 10 times more delicious i don't know if you guys used to take like your thin mint girl scout cookies and keep them in the freezer but it's kind of like that because i don't know what it is but just having them cold just makes them so good all right i only have a few more items to mention and the next one is trader joe's chicken fried rice if you have not tried this by now then you are missing out because this is one of the best items at trader joe's it is pretty bomb guys and you can actually get a different one if you don't like chicken they have one that doesn't have chicken if you do end up making this i highly recommend cooking this for a lot longer than it says on the package and like waiting for it to get really crispy like you'll see it getting like nice and brown and crispy because it just tastes so much better i love having this on hand for those nights when you just don't feel like cooking and want something super easy and yummy maybe it's the weekend you know you're running out of groceries whatever it is this is just such a quick and easy dinner kind of obsessed with chips so i had to try out these organic white truffle potato chips and they are um freaking amazing because they have white truffle seasoning on them it kind of makes you feel like you're eating at a restaurant because i feel like that's the only time i ever really have truffle seasoning or like that super crunchy potato chip so they're absolutely delicious i know you guys will love them definitely try them out for yourself so i have another really yummy chip option this one i actually get all the time because it's just too good and they're like a healthier like pringles option so they are these trader joe's sea salted saddle potato crisps my boyfriend actually said he likes these better than the original like pringles so if that doesn't tell you that they're delicious then i don't know what will it's like a little thicker than pringles but yeah they're just so freaking good that i just can't stop buying them next up we do have another one of my go-to items that i always mention in all of my trader joe's videos but this is trader joe's organic jasmine rice it's literally the best it's so fluffy so delicious and it only takes three minutes to make and you get two servings from one bag of these and there's like three separate bags in here so it's like the best deal ever and just perfect for quick healthy meals and that's what i am all about i like to make my life easier when it comes to cooking and this does exactly that so as you can see there are so many delicious items at trader joe's i just freaking love it there they have so many unique items that you just can't find anywhere else do you try to live a very healthy lifestyle so bear in mind that i do always check the back of these and like check the ingredients and like see how unhealthy they are 
and if I determine that they are just too unhealthy then I probably won't get them but if they're like not that bad or if I plan to like not have them all the time then I will just send it and get them hope you guys will try out some of these items because I'm seriously so obsessed with them like I said in the beginning of the video if you have any Trader Joe's suggestions for me then definitely let me know in the comments below because I'm always trying to try new stuff out and I just love sharing it with you but yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this thank you guys so much for watching i will see you in my next video bye